Some of you might already know this, but did you know that pulling is a scam? There is a better way to get the unity one, and that is through this little button right here. Let me tell you how. Limbus has this good mechanic where you can farm your battle pass level to get more boxes. The box contain 1 to 3 ego shards where you can then either exchange into IDs for that same unit or convert it into threads. For new players, it is fine to pull on banners to get some units to help with your progress. But once you are set and you could do stages comfortably, like even in mirror dungeon, you should stop pulling. Did you know that the rates of getting 3 stars and ego is only 2.9% and 1.3% respectively? So, on average, you'll be getting 3 stars once every 35 pulls and an ego once every 77 pulls or so. Do you know, with one simple trick, you could get up to 15 more units with the same amount of pull. Let's assume that whole season is 130 days, and you refresh from the start of the season to the end of the season. It will cost you 3,380 lunacy if you refresh once, and 10,140 lunacy if you refresh twice. If you refresh twice, you should be getting 13 more modules each day, which can be 2.6 of mirror dungeon run every day. A mirror dungeon run can get you 3 boxes, or 9 if you buy battle pass. If you refresh and use the modules to farm mirror dungeon, it can get you 1,014 or 3042 boxes at the end of the season, which you can then exchange to around 5 3 stars or 15 3 stars if you buy a battle pass. But it is fine even if you don't do mirror dungeon every day, it will help you build a reserve or modules, which can help you when you need them to farm luxification or threats, which in my opinion is a waste if you don't farm without the bonus. I will suggest to use a skip. If you are farming threads, because skipping means you do one in sun run at the cost and rewards of two runs, one with bonus and another one without. But then there will be people saying farming mirror dungeon is better than skip on threads. Sure, it might be better if you buy battle pass, but remember that you save time and get more threads in the long run, even if you buy battle pass by refreshing and doing both. The reason why you need so much stress is applying units to tier 4 just took a lot of stress and ego shirts. Events mostly use modules too, like with the events we had, health chicken and sea. So, it is a good thing to have a reserve of modules. You should be spending around 14 modules each day for dailies. It would be 2 modules for XP excavation and 12 modules for the threat excavation. You will get around 12 modules each day without refresh and around 25 if you refresh twice. That means you get 11 modules surplus each day that you can use it for mirror dungeon runs or just save it for future usage. So, just don't pull and use the lunacy to exchange module and farm instead. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time. Goodbye!